Look, let's be honest, okay? After 375 years, it's not like you're all of a sudden gonna become a different city. It's not like you're gonna wake up tomorrow and become Brandon, Manitoba, you know? Montrealers don't like change unless they're throwing it at a stripper. <laughs> you do have to change your ways. You've got to get yourself back on track. If you're not gonna do it for yourself, do it for the same reason Montreal does everything. Don't do it for me. Don't do it for your health. Do it to piss off Toronto. <laughs> Absolutely, you know. Because Montrealers, you can be a little, on behalf of the rest of the country, you can be a little whiny. You know? You're always whining about how distinct you are. We're distinct, we're different. We're distinct. We're, we're, we're more fun than Saskatchewan. Yeah, who isn't, you know? <laughs> we have our own language. Yeah, look, I'm from Newfoundland, okay? <laughs> we have our own language too. <laughs> we don't just ram it down people's throats though, okay? Canada has two official languages, English and French. In Newfoundland, we have three, English, French, and even we don't know what we're saying. <laughs> Imagine how annoying it would be if everywhere you went, there were all the signs were in English, French, and Newfoundland. Hey? You go up to Ottawa, you see a sign, Government of Canada. Gouvernement du Canada. Bunch of arseholes. It's no fun. 